another chopstick bowl in the works. First, I wheel wedge the clay, center it, and then open it up. Now I use a sponge to keep the clay hydrated as I raise the walls of the pot. For this pot, I want a narrow bottom and a wider rim. I'm busy making chopstick bowls to replenish the inventory, getting ready for my fall sales, as my chopstick bowls are one of my better sellers. I set the foot and use a metal rib to smooth and shape the pot into its finished form. Then I smooth the upper rim and now I shape the rim for where the chopsticks will rest. Cut it off and then it's on to making